Hey guys, welcome back. So got a swatch and review and kind of look-see into video on the BH Cosmetics Carly Bible Palette. This is the new deluxe edition. So it's the larger version of her original palette. This is the new one, so the deluxe edition. So we're gonna do like we normally do in my review videos. We'll talk about the pricing, we'll look at the packaging, um, I'll show you some swatches, let you know my thoughts on the formula, and then I'll also kind of show you like the difference between the two. Basically, this one just has new shades added to it. So it has the same shades as this one, but now more are included in this one. So I'll be sure and point out the new shades to y'all. So let's get to the video. So I purchased my palette from Carly's website, which I believe is pronounced Pranava Beauty, and it was $19.50, but you can also purchase it from BH Cosmetics as well. As far as the packaging, it is a cardboard um, packaging to it, but it feels nice and sturdy. It looks pretty, kind of like a pillow top sort of a it looks like pillows, like it has the little, you know, gatherings of a pillow. So it looks really pretty. I think BH does a great job of doing affordable packaging, but that's still nice and sturdy and still cute and pretty looking. So this is what it looks like as far as size difference. It is um, not quite double the size, but you know, close to, I don't know, maybe like a third bigger or something like that. So, and it looks a little bit lighter if anything, but they're really close. Um, so yeah, that's the packaging. As far as the inside of the palette, you do get a mirror up here, which is really nice. And then you get three rows of shadows and then you get one, two, three, four, five, six highlighters. And yes, this is what it looks like. Let me compare it with the original one. Okay, I had to get this all situated here. So here they are all situated. So the top is the original and the bottom is the new deluxe version. So you can see, I mean, all of these are in this palette. There's just added on shadows in here. Um, and overall, it's just a very warm tone palette. So a lot of golds, a lot of coppers, um, kind of like rosy sort of shades, sort of purpley shades, but just a very warm tone to it overall. So you have to like those kind of like coppery, warm sunset, bridal sort of um, makeup looks to I think enjoy either of these palettes, but this is the new one that's available still. So you have to like those kind of warm toned eye looks to appreciate this palette. So let's get to some swatches. Okay, so starting with the eyeshadow. So these are the three rows of eyeshadows. The first row, the middle row, and then the bottom row there. As far as which ones are new, the entire first row, those are all new shadows. This one right here, that's a new one. That is the middle row, fourth from the left or second from the right. And then this one right here, the middle one of the third row, that's a new shadow. As far as favorites, I really like the new ones, like several of the new ones, this one and this one. So pretty and metallic, love that one. I have that on my lid, really, really beautiful. So I like those a lot. I really like this blending shade here. It's a really pretty kind of like rosy pink. I have that in my crease today. It's beautiful. That one's really pretty, another blending shade. So those are my favorites from the shadows. Then for the highlighters, and these could totally be used as eyeshadows too. This is the row of the larger ones. So that's the one on the left. That's the one on the right, and that is a new one. And then these are the four on the bottom. And as far as which ones are new here, that one is new and that one is new. I have this one on the inner corners of my eyes and a little bit of this one, a little bit of that on my lower lash line too. They're just all so bright and fun and metallic. Oh my goodness, they are beautiful. I think this one's gonna make an incredible blush topper just cause it has that like peachy pinky sort of a tone to it gorgeous. Then as far as texture, blendability, and performance of these products, the eyeshadows are really good. Are they the best eyeshadow formula I've ever used? No, they are a little bit powdery. They do kick up some product in the pan, but they're still really good, especially for the price point. They blend really well. They work well together. They wear well throughout the day. They're easy to work with. They're just maybe a little bit messy in the pan, which is totally not a game changer for me. I still really like these shadows. As far as the highlighters go, really nice quality too, very pigmented. Um, they're kind of that thicker sort of a texture to them where I would say build them up slowly because they really get intense really quickly just because they have that kind of thicker texture to them. So they might take a little bit of tweaking for how you apply them, but they're still 
super nice, especially for the price point. I think this is a great palette. I'm really enjoying it. I think she did a great job of upgrading this palette from the original. The original was still really good, but this one is even better because I like the new shadows and the new highlighters in here. So I'm really enjoying it. I think it's really nice quality, really affordable, and just a beautiful palette. All right guys, so that's my overall review on the BH Cosmetics Carly Bible Deluxe Edition palette. So I hope that you really enjoyed this video and I hope it was helpful for you. Please hit a thumbs up if it was and let me know down below if you've tried this palette. What do you think about it? I would love to know your thoughts and opinions. Ask me any questions that you have. I'm happy to answer those. Please subscribe to my channel if you're not already and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.